It's a shocker. I can't believe it. Outside St. Nicholas of Tolentine School in the Bronx, parents say the news that their school is shutting down came as a surprise to everyone. When they give the notice to the teacher, she was crying in front of the class. So that's not fair. The Archdiocese says declining enrollment is forcing it to close seven schools in June, including in Manhattan, St. Rose of Lima, St. Bridget Elementary, on Staten Island, Our Lady Help of Christians, in the Bronx, St. Nicholas of Tolentine, as we mentioned, and St. Joseph Elementary School, in Duchess, St. Mary Elementary School, Wabinger's Falls, and in Sullivan, St. Peter's Regional School, Liberty. You know, I'd rather be opening some new ones instead of closing some of the gems that we got, but reality sets in. The Archdiocese currently serves more than 62,000 students from pre-K through 12th grade, but it says buildings are underutilized and others need significant repairs that are not feasible. Cardinal Dolan says parents will have other options for their kids. All the kids in these schools that are closing are going to be able to go to another Catholic school nearby, all but one. They'll be immediate, enthusiastically welcomed into a near, nearby Catholic school. But parents told us they feel stuck and don't know what to do now. Agnes Garcia has three children at St. Rose of Lima in Harlem. We're trying to get some answers. We're not getting any answers, and we feel horrible. We're trying to, to find out what school they're going to go to and what the best for them, the scholarships, if there's some of them need help. It's going to be rough because it's a lot of inconvenience for people living in the neighborhood close. You drop your key, you go to work, you pick it up. Now, the Archdiocese says it plans to host informational meetings for parents interested in applying for financial aid and scholarships for the 2019-2020 school year. Christina Maurice.